Hello everyone. Today I'm going to uh, give the final tips to score good marks in class 10 science board exam 2023. So let us start uh, the tips which you have to follow before science exam. So first of all, you have to complete the entire syllabus from NCRT. And as the question paper uh, of the board exam is always based on NCRT, uh, therefore first complete the entire syllabus from the class 10th NCRT uh, science book textbook to understand the concepts of each and every chapter and uh, you should know you should aware with the board pattern also blueprint of the uh, exam also uh, means I have also prepared the blueprint based on the official sample paper of CBSE which was published uh, on 16 September 2022. Uh, I will give the link of that blueprint also. So student must aware of the split up of different types of questions uh, uh, means question paper ka pattern pata hona chahiye aur kaun se chapter se kitne marks ke aa sakte hai. Right. Now after that uh, you have to maintain a separate book or A4 size paper for definition, diagram, theories and methods. Uh, light and electricity chapter specially. It is all about the formula, theories and concepts. So you are always uh, suggested to keep uh, them handy. This practice is really useful when you are doing a, a last minute revision. Right? So now uh, as uh, the science have uh, is divided into three streams. So one is physics, uh, biology, chemistry. So let us look, uh, let us see one by one for physics. In physics, uh, conceptual and formula based uh, Questions are mostly asked in the exam, okay? And uh, so the student must thorough with all the important formulas and it should be in their fingertips. And uh, you have to practice different types of numericals from light chapter and uh, electricity chapter. And uh, you have to practice all diagrams also like lines of magnetic field around a solenoid and a bar magnet and electric circuit diagram, image formation by lenses and mirrors and the human eye, glass prisms, uh, image formation for both defected and correct vision. I think this is uh, deleted, so uh, this is not required. Okay, fine. Now uh, for chemistry, this section is a, a very easy, easiest and highest scoring section in science, but one needs to be very clear with the concepts. Learn the tips involving in balancing chemical equation in first chapter and the first chapter is of uh, a good weightage also so and also memorize the applications of acids bases and salts in everyday life now every year two three questions are asked from salts and its compounds so student must know the common names preparation chemical formula and uses of salts and its compounds and focus on carbon compounds and its nomenclature containing functional groups Prepare short notes on reminders of formulas along with compound names to revise. These revision notes will assist in you. It will help you in your last minute preparation. Now these are some tips for chemistry. Now we'll move towards biology. Uh, this is the theoretical section uh, with lot of terminologies to memorize. So one should be, uh, one must also practice all the diagrams uh, thoroughly and make notes of terms and their associated functions to learn and revise, especially during the last time revision. In biology, student must uh, practice diagrams like the representation of reflex action, uh, respiratory system, uh, human brain, different parts of flowers, female and male reproductive organs, etc. Thoroughly prepare Mendel's experiments and understand the traits and uh, traits inheritance. Now biology comprises of several complex diagrams, therefore student must build a habit of drawing a neat and clean diagram while writing the answers. This will also help them in scoring uh, good marks. Now uh, the units which carry more marks in the question paper should be given more time to practice. Just now I told that uh, the chapter, for the first chapter contains a good marks, so such type of chapters, units you have to uh, give more times to practice. After completing the entire syllabus from the NCRT book, complete my minimum level uh, learning study material and then go through the previous year's board exam questions. It gives a broader view of the questions to be asked in the paper. Moreover, it provides 
more questions to the students to do practice i will give the link of my minimum level learning study material in the description box now after completing uh, completing the revision work solve cbsc official sample paper uh, which was published by cbsc for science board exam right now uh, one more tips uh, before exam start from section e that is four marks questions case study based questions then section d five marks then section c three marks questions and so on means e d c b a and either you can start it from section d then e c b a but a jo one mark question hai i will suggest to attempt last because many students will take more time uh, for one mark question aur kuch bacche five marks ke questions ya four marks ke question chhod dete hain so i will suggest the time management for section wise uh, see this one so first uh, one mark question total 20 questions are there 16 plus 4 16 general mcq 4 assertion reasoning based questions and maximum 2 minutes if you take so 20 into 2 40 minutes now two mark question there are six questions and uh, the time per question should be 2 to 3 minutes so 6 into 3 18 so let it be 20 minutes and uh, three marks question there are seven questions and uh, the time per question should be 3 to 5 or uh, max uh, all together 35 minutes and five marks questions only three questions are there so time allotted is 3 to 10 minutes uh, 7 to 10 minutes so maximum 30 minutes now coming to three case study case uh, questions so 10 to 40 uh, 15 minutes 10 to 15 minutes so uh, maximum uh, uh, 45 minutes 3 into 15 now if we add all together we are getting 170 minutes so 10 minutes revision revision time and total 180 minutes so these uh, is the suggested time management it may vary with uh, for uh, different students so now uh, attempt all my sample papers which i am going to publish in my um, means uh, my blog and my target is to publish around 15 sample papers till your board exam along with answer so using this time man management you can attempt all the uh, sample papers i will publish during evening time uh, 6 to 9 timing will be there because before that i will conduct the maths exam so 6 to 9 ke baad mein i will post uh, upload the answer keys also for self evaluation around 9:30 or 10 so uh, practicing uh, Uh, doing enough practice of sample papers will definitely boost the level of self confidence of all the students so i will give the link also i will give the link of that uh, particular web page of uh, uploading the sample papers and uh, if you uh, follow the suggested time management for all the sample papers i'm sure you will be able to complete the full paper in 2 and 1/2 hours so uh, practicing the sample papers will teach the concepts of time management to all the students so i'm sure that this exercise will help you uh, to complete your board exam in 2 and 1/2 hours now these are the tips before science exam now the tips for during science exam so first 15 minutes are very crucial very important so read the question paper with uh, with full concentration and uh, use the 15 minutes first 15 minutes Uh, reading time carefully and effectively by going through the uh, through the question paper and at least twice and mark all the questions in which uh, you are very confident and if it seems uh, very easy and difficult as well as and you have to leave the difficult questions for last right first attempt those questions which you are sure about starting from e to a or you can mix up d e uh, then uh, c b a but uh, one thing you have to uh, uh, means uh, you have to concentrate that whatever section you are starting you please try to follow the sequence for example two mark question six questions are there so 21 to 26 to jumble nahi karenge aap so 21 22 23 suppose you are not able to do 23 leave some space and move toward the other questions okay kuch bachcho ko के स्टडी क्वेश्चन बहुत डिफिकल्ट लगता है सो यू कैन लीव के स्टडी क्वेश्चन टू अटेम्प्ट लेटर बिफोर फर्स्ट वन मार्क क्वेश्चन यू कैन स्टार्ट फ्रॉम सेक्शन डी राइट नाउ यू हैव टू अंडरस्टैंड द वर्थ ऑफ ईच क्वेश्चन नेवर स्पेंड टू मच टाइम जैसे फॉर टू मार्क्स क्वेश्चन डोंट स्पेंड फाइव टू टेन मार्क्स टेन मिनट्स 
if you don't know the solution for a particular question leave some space for that question and move on to the next question right now answer should answer sheet should be neat and clean rough work should be done on the same page by drawing a margin for specially numerical do not cut the rough work if you could not get the answer partial marks may be given for time work done sometime so avoid overwriting so sometime means kabhi kabhi aisa hota hai ki rough mein kiya hua hum log fair nahi kar pate so you may get partial marks for that right and uh, you have to use pencil and scale to draw the diagrams never draw a diagram with the use of a pen don't leave any questions unattempted because there is no negative marking okay you have to write something related to the topic write down anything you know about the question even if it is wrong there is no negative marking so attempting a question even if you don't know the answer completely will not hurt okay so now never lose your patience during the exam if you do not know the answers to any questions do not lose your patience after completing the familiar questions uh, take a long breath so this is take take a long breath and think about the concepts involved involved in that particular question this will definitely help you to recall some steps some uh, information about that question so you can write also you can attempt also next you have to revise 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 it's a great that you get done with the paper before the time if you complete the paper before the time so you have to revise your answers do not leave the exam hall just yet after kuch bacche hote hain jo complete hote hi room se bahar nikal jate hain so don't do that you have to revise take a breath relax and start going through your answers double check your calculations and numericals making sure you have not committed any silly mistakes always remember once you leave the exam hall then there is no way uh, get back and see your answer once again right so don't uh, leave the exam hall before rev uh, revising your answer paper right now don't leave the easy questions till the end kuch bachche kya karte hain pehle difficult questions attempt karte hain so uh, if you attempt the difficult questions uh, first so what will happen it will decrease your confidence वहाँ पे कॉन्फिडेंस लूज हो जाएगा इट विल टेक लॉट ऑफ टाइम ऑल्सो इट विल कंज्यूम लॉट ऑफ टाइम सो दैट इज वाई डोंट लीव द इजी क्वेश्चन टिल द एंड ओवर द ईयर ऑफ टीचिंग टू स्कूल स्टूडेंट आई हैव नोटिस दिस वेरी कॉमन टेंडेंसी ऑफ स्टूडेंट्स टू अटेम द डिफिकल्ट क्वेश्चन राइट फ्रॉम द बिगिनिंग स्टार्ट विद इजी क्वेश्चन गेट वार्म अप एंड यू विल फाइंड दैट यू विल गो थ्रू द क्वेश्चन पेपर अ लॉट मोर स्मूथली दैन बिफोर so this will help you finish the paper before time also and reduce the likelihood of making silly mistakes now one more very important that over preparation is a problem so i have noticed uh, many times that students see similar question that they may have subsequently committed to memory and write them without going through the uh, problem statement right so these are uh, some tips uh, before examination during examination for your Class 10 Science Board Exam 2023. I wish you all the best for your future. Okay, so all the best. Thank you. Thank you very much.